most people. Yo, 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 what up YouTube? Welcome to CN Take Man. My name is Jay Sin. Coming back with another one. And as y'all can see, we coming live from the Rose Garden. Take a look at it. Take a look at it, man. We got another one out here, man. So y'all already know. I gotta thank the most high for waking me up this morning and giving me another opportunity to be great. And I wanna send a big shout out to my brother and my ancestors that's up there looking out for your boy. I love y'all. I love y'all, look at that, you know, beautiful day, around the way, you know, but man, yo, I really wanted y'all to see that clip, man, posted by Upset the Gram, you know, shout out to them, go follow them on uh, Instagram, Upset the Gram, go follow them, and uh, man, you know, that brother was on point with that message, bro. He was on point with that message, man. And that's why we got to continue to go by faith. You know what I'm saying? Instead of looking and going by feedback. You know, because if you depended on that feedback all the time, then listen, bro. You know, you just only limiting yourself. Because nine times out of ten, if you're not getting the feedback that you want, you're going to quit. And we're seeing a lot of people that's not going by faith. They're not doing what the Most High telling them to do. They're not doing what their spirit telling them to do. They're not doing what the Hamashiach want them to do. You know, instead, you know, they going and, you know, just relying on the feedback from views, the feedback from people, the feedback from family, you know, the feedback from likes, you know? And that's not what, that's not how it's supposed to be. But that's how this programming is set up. You know what I'm saying? And that's why it's important for you to have a relationship with the Most High. Because the Most High, like, listen, bro. <laughs> we're not doing it for that, bro. We're not doing it. We're not doing it for clout, bro. You know, we're not doing it for money. You know, we're not doing it for attention, bro. We're not doing it for no feedback, man. You got faith or what? Well, then just do what I tell you to do. That's what your father, <laughs> that's what your father do, you know? For any of y'all that got kids, when you tell your kid to do something, they always, you know, just got a, some type of rebuttal or always got to ask why, you know, every time, like, listen, bro, you know, at some point you're going to be like, look, because I told you to do it. You know, I'm not telling you to do this for my health. I'm telling you to do it because it's what's right. I'm telling you to do it because I care. I'm telling you to do it because I'm telling you to do it because, you know, it needs to get done, you know? It's for your own good. That's why I'm telling you to do it, you know? But when it's like, you know, when you when you just start leaning on this world and you start leaning on your own understanding, then guess what, bro? You're going to find yourself off task. You're going to find yourself aborting the mission. You're going to find yourself quitting. You know, you're going to find yourself unmotivated. You're going to find yourself not driven because you just leaning on the feedback, bro. You lean, you leaning on the response instead of leaning on the faith, bro. You know, and that's what you got to do in these times, man. You can't, you can't rely on all of this worldly stuff. Just listen to the most high. And when you tapped in, if you tapped in, you would know that already, bro. 
you will know that already, bro. You will feel that ruach. You know, you will feel the spirit in you just driving you, being the driving force, just pushing you, helping you through whatever it is that you're going through, giving you that extra strength, extra energy, you know, to where you're doing things. And like I said, you don't even know, like, how you even found the strength to do it. You don't even know, like, bro, like, you don't even know how you even found the time to even get it done. You don't even know, like, you know, how you was able to even say or do the things that you was doing. Like, dang, how did I get through that? You know, how did I even do that? You know, you will start just seeing, like, these wonders just happen, you know, in your purpose. You will see wonders happen in your process, bro. You know, because you keep going. You know, you have the faith. You just like going by that and you're not worried about anything else. And you don't even realize, bro, that's when you at your best. For any of y'all that even, you know, saw the movie Karate Kid, you know, the first one when he just got irritated. He got so irritated at Mr. Miyagi because Mr. Miyagi had him painting fences. You know what I'm saying? Mr. Miyagi had him waxing his cars and all that stuff. Mr. Miyagi had him just doing this work. And he like, bruh, I thought I was supposed to be learning how to fight, man. I got these bullies on my ass. They whooping my ass, they chase me every day. And you said you was gonna teach me how to fight. But instead, I'm in this mug waxing your dang on car. I mean, I'm out here painting your dang on fence. You know what I'm saying? I'm out here doing all this, man. What's, what's what, what am I doing here? What are we doing? And then Mr. Miyagi had to check him like, look, stand right here. He made him stand in front of him. And he didn't even realize that, you know, when he was waxing that car, he was learning how to, how to, how to, how to, how to block a punch. You know, when he was waxing that car, he was learning how to block a punch. You know what I'm saying? When he was painting that fence he didn't even know that that was how to block a fence from hitting you in the face like boom that's the strokes that he was doing boom that's he didn't even know that he was doing that he was learning how to de uh uh defend himself you know what i'm saying so it's like sometimes you don't even realize it you know what i mean you don't even realize the work that's being done with you while you in your process you know what i'm saying you don't even realize the work that's being done with you while you following those laws and commandments and staying close to the most high you don't even know what work is being done to you while you on your purpose while you continuing to put in work on yourself you don't even know what type of work is being done to you mentally you know what I'm saying? When you're not allowing the outside world to get to you, when you're not focused on what people's opinions are or the hate that they give or the thoughts, the likes, the views, when you're not focused on none of that feedback, you don't even know, bruh. You just focused on the mission, bruh, and you just getting stronger, you getting wiser. You know what I'm saying? You getting better, you know? And that's why you gotta have that faith because that's what faith does. You know what I'm saying? You're not stressed like everybody else. You know how that's when people start stressing out the most and want to quit because they didn't put all their power into other people. They didn't put all their power into the world. You know what I'm saying? They started focusing on all that stuff, you know, and, and because they not getting it, you know, then, then, then there you go. They want to quit and they quitting it. If they not getting it, then they quitting it. You know what I'm saying? And that's just a terrible way to go about things. That's one. That's a one-way ticket to lose out on your blessings, bro. That's a one-way ticket to lose out on achieving your goals, your dreams. You know, that's a one-way ticket to failure right there. That's a one-way ticket to failure, man. So whatever it is that y'all are doing, man, continue to have a faith in that. You know what I'm saying? And continue to put in work because what we know, we know that. Faith without works is dead. You know what I'm saying? So the work that you putting in behind whatever it is that you do, that's all that matter. You know, when you have faith, all that matter is the work that you putting in on yourself, the work that you putting in on your dreams, the work that you putting in on your foot, on your purpose, the works that you putting in with the most high. That's all that matter. They can't nobody control that. That's why they be so mad. That's why they be trying to throw you off. That's why they want to insert themselves in their opinions. And then they get pissed because it doesn't matter to you. Because you still going. You have faith. So you're not relying on what they got to say. You have faith. So you're not relying on what they have to say. 
You know what I'm saying? And now they gotta get out the way. You know why? Because you don't play. And the most high don't play about his either. You know what I'm saying? You gotta understand that the Hamashiach don't play about his either. You know? So you gotta keep going, bruh. You gotta keep going no matter what, man. You know, that's let everybody else stress out about all that stuff. That's because they in this world, bro. You ain't in this world. You in your own world. You in the most high's world. You know what I'm saying? You in that, you in your faith. You in your bag. You know what I'm saying? You're not in, you, you're not in the crowd with them. You know, that's why I tell you, bro. You in the lane of your own. You know what I'm saying? You in the lane of your own, bro. It is time for you to start acting like it. You know what I'm saying? And stay focused out here, man. Too many people lose and focus, letting all that, all this stuff that they done created, you know, get to them, bro. You ain't got to participate in that. It don't apply to you when you with the most high. Don't you know that these things of this world don't apply to you when you with, when you with the most high? That's why the most high want to pull you out of it. That's why the Hamashiach want to pull you out of it. Tell you to leave that alone. You just, just think about us. Just worry about what, what, what we telling you, not what the world telling you, not what these girls telling you, not what, not what anybody else telling you. Just worry about what we telling you and just keep going. You know what I mean? You go, you're going to be blessed, nothing less. You already are, but you got to stay focused. You got to go through the fire. You got to get proved. You know what I'm saying? So keep proving, keep proving, keep doing, keep moving. All right? And that's my word, man. My name is Jason. It's Take. Holla at y'all later, man. Peace.